way back to 1958 when he got the call to start a children's show here at WCBI-TV. The rest, as they say, is history. History barely scratches the surface of the life and legacy left by our pal, Uncle Bucky. You two, all right. <laughs> I got you on one note. For 18 years and 60 minutes a day, five days a week, with 12 kids in the audience, Uncle Bunky will draw crazy animals for kids of all ages. Alligators, foxes, rabbits, kitty cats, you name it, Bunky drew it. And always with a smile. Oh, what's this tail? Just like that. Look at that. <laughs> Y'all like that? Right? Okay, I'll bet one. Many years after his time at WCBI, he continued to draw for kids in the area, even during his years when he worked the Lowndes County Sheriff's Department. No matter what, when, or where, Bunky was ready with a pen and paper to draw for kids. And yes, always with a smile. What for the bag feet? A duck. A duck? The little duck's feet like this? Do you know the duck and the goose are cousins? Okay, we still go. Y'all gonna get me to put a stool, I think, on every one of these. Up until his passing, he was still drawing crazy animals. It was his life's work and what he loved to do. But nothing could come close to the passion he had for his family, his loving and caring wife, Joyce, and of course, sports. Walking through his main cave at his home in Columbus is like walking through sports history, most notably with his favorite team, the Chicago Cubs. Bunky never did get a chance to see his beloved Cubs win it all, nor did he get to see them play at Wrigley Field. But maybe, just maybe, something will go out of the way. Yeah, something will go out of the way. He will get to see them go all the way with the best seat in the house, sitting next to Ron Santo and Ernie Banks up in heaven this year. Harry, Harry's going to sing, take me out to the ball game. <laughs> Over 152,000 people on our WCBI News Facebook page have been reached with our story on Bunky's passing, with hundreds of comments remembering the good times and the fun times shared with our dear friend. But truly trying to quantify the lives changed with Bunky's presence is impossible. It's hard to put into words how much Uncle Bunky meant to us. But for 83 years, he was put on this earth to delight and put a smile on any person's face he happened to meet. Look at that, okay? You all like that one? Okay. So it's not goodbye, but it's farewell for now to our beloved friend and companion. Though it wouldn't be fair to say so long without Bunky doing it for us. And, and Audrey, we, we always close the show. Uh-huh. When I count three, is it time to close? It's time to close. When I count three, y'all say, see you later, alligator, loud as you can. One, two, three. We tell you, see you later, alligator bucky. We'll be right back. Close captioning is brought to you.